Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, thank you for joining me. So before I always get started on, before I get started on next week's spread, I always recap the week before. Um, so I have great news, you guys. I stuck to my meal plan. Um, I may not have made everything that I was supposed to make, but I did not snack, any bad snacks. I did no fast food. I'm so proud of myself, even the weekend. The weekends, I don't know if it's just me, but the weekends, I usually fall completely off the wagon and it's not really good. Saturday, I mean Sundays, Saturdays, yeah, Saturdays and Sundays, because I run errands and I do different things, I usually am grabbing stuff on the way or while I'm out, fast food, of course. Um, but this weekend, I did not deviate from the plan. The only thing, um, Saturday, oh, I had leftover, I had got rotisserie chicken, um, Friday night, so I had leftover chicken so I had that Saturday I had my Greek yogurt in the morning Sunday oh yeah that's why because I'm trying to recap I'm trying to think of what was going on in the weekend so Saturday was freezing cold outside um, we had high winds and without the wind it was about 13 degrees with the wind blowing the wind chill factor was negative 10 so I have made it my business not to go out on Saturday, even though I had to wash clothes. So Friday night after I got done working, that's when I went to the store and picked up the chicken. And I came home and I made roasted zucchini, roasted uh, yellow squash and butternut squash with that. Um, and then, that's, so yeah, that was Saturday. Sunday, um, I had to, I had to, even though it was cold out, I had to just get up, brave the cold, 17 degrees, hit the laundromat and I ran out of yogurt. So I, I got, I got some yogurt. I got some more grapes cause I ran out of grapes. I've been eating them, snacking on them all week. Um, and, um, I forgot what else I picked up a couple other things. Um, Oh, and I was in, I, I wanted some pork chops, so I was like, let me see if there's anything on sale, and so I picked um, some pork chops up, and I baked them. I did not fry them like I wanted to. Um, I ended up baking those and had string beans with that for dinner, and I had a peanut butter sandwich for lunch and my yogurt in the morning, and I... I am so surprised because after the laundromat, like the laundromat is in this little plaza and right like two, two stores over is, um, I think it's Wayback Burgers, Jake's Wayback Burgers or something like that. And their stuff is really good. And I was starving, did not go in there. Um, I did not, I usually pick up Wendy's on my way home and I usually eat Wendy's while I am either putting, a, no, I don't eat while I'm putting away clothes. That doesn't make any sense. My hands are greasy. Um, but usually I'll, when I go grocery shopping or run errands on Saturday, I will uh, go to Wendy's after and pick up something to eat and eat that while I watch YouTube videos, planning YouTube videos. I did not go to Wendy's, McDonald's, Burger King, Popeye's, None of those places. Um, I'm really like trying to stay laser focused. And I did not get any chips, guys. No chips. Not even the small bags at the register. Like I went in there Friday laser focused. Like I need to get a couple of things and I'm out. And then Sunday after I went to the laundromat, like I said, I just remembered I was out of Greek yogurt. And... um something else I just said the Greek yogurt the pork chops oh and the grapes and I went I didn't even realize it till I got in the car and I was like oh my gosh you didn't even check the chip aisle you didn't go buy it you didn't think about it like I just went in got what I had to to get and I was out of there 
Okay, so I am proud of myself. The lunch here is empty because I didn't have lunch. Um, because I'm, sometimes I get up later than I'm supposed to and it kind of throws my day off for eating. So um, I actually had the veggie omelet was more closer to lunch because I, I, I didn't eat like early enough. So that's why lunch looks like I didn't like... I didn't eat anything or I don't want you guys to think like I ate bad even here on Saturday. It's just that I ate later and so it just pushes everything down. Um, so that's what that's about. It's not that I had anything bad and didn't report it or I didn't eat anything. It's just um, I just ate later than usual. Um, my water still no bueno. I'm working on that. It's definitely a work in progress. Um, so eating healthy, I killed that all week and kept my exercise schedule. I did Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Friday, I, um, had to work an extra, I worked 12 hours on Friday because one of these days I was so tired that I missed a couple hours. So I worked 12 hours on Friday and then I ran to the store. So I didn't make it to the gym. Saturday, like I said, was way too cold, way too cold. And then Tuesday was another cold day, but I already said in my last video, I probably wouldn't go Tuesday. But the good thing is for Sunday, even just doing errands, I got over 10,000 steps on Sunday. So I think that kind of takes off one of the days. So it's still like a two day thing. I'm giving myself grace. It says for us to give ourselves grace, guys. I'm giving myself grace. Okay, so I am so proud of myself. So I am filming this today. I'm filming it and uploading it today, Monday. And um, I got up this morning and I was like bugging out because I was like, you didn't meal plan. What are you going to eat this week? You didn't plan anything. You're going to screw yourself. What are you doing? And then I was like, wait a minute. I planned for two weeks and I was like oh my gosh I was so happy about that so that's a great thing because I totally forgot about it yesterday so maybe I am just gonna keep doing that planning for two weeks in advance well two weeks two weeks so that way um I don't have to keep going to, to spend money. And then when I, like I said, when I run out on little things, I think I spent about $20 on, on, um, Friday. No, yesterday, Sunday. Spent about $20 Sunday. Um, I didn't notice though when I came home and I hate when this happens, but again, I was, I forgot I had, I was meal planning. And <laughs> so if I would have remembered when I got up Saturday, I would have been ready um, to get the stuff that I needed for this week because I am running out of green peppers and red peppers. I think I have enough of everything else, especially because like the salmon I didn't have because I think that's the day I had the rotisserie chicken. So I have my salmon left. So I have a few things and the cauliflower they didn't have. I was going to make roasted cauliflower one night and they didn't have it at the stores. They had no heads of cauliflower. So when I went back to the store, when I got the butternut squash, they had the heads of cauliflower, so I'll have that one night, the roasted, and I'm going to make it work for this week. I do need to get water. I am out of water, so I need to go to the store. I need my water and, what did I say, green and red peppers. Okay, so for this week, I wanted to do like a floral theme, but I wanted to keep everything else like black. So I'm going to use um these florals i needed something to pop because it's been like kind of dreary and really sad here so i'm gonna use these i need something popping on my page and everything else is gonna be black um this video would have went up earlier but i can't even tell you guys how many sticker books i had to go through to try to get some stickers but I'm gonna use I'll probably use some of um, the quotes from the black and white happy planner sticker book um, I just pulled it because they have some stuff see small steps lead to big results 
Um, we simply are worthy as is. And, you know, never forget how wildly capable you are. So they have some good motivational. And look at these. Stay present. Good things are ahead. You can and you will. You guys know that one. Celebrate each little victory. So uh, there's some in here I may use. Um, and then for workout, um, for my workout stickers, I use, uh, why do I have two of the orange? I usually go through these. So the orange fitness from Happy Planner and then the Healthy Hero sticker book and the accessory. And then it's a good thing I did go through my stickers because I forgot about these from Capital Chic Designs. These, the small little sticker pack for fitness. So I'm going to use my girls. I forgot about my girls. And they're in black and white. So this is going to be perfect with the flowers. I'm hoping. I got two of them because I loved it so much the first time I grabbed another one. Um, these were at Michael's. I am not sure if they are still there. I know they did a crazy sale for Capital Chic Designs because I'm not sure if they were restocking. So, um, if you don't have them and you want them, check Michael's. I believe she has a website. I never, I've never gone to her website. Um, this is from uh, Lamika Smith. I mean, oh, Lamika Smith, I'm sorry. Lamika Alston. Um, I, I've never been to her website, so I'm not sure if these are available there, but I this is where I got them from Michaels, and I will leave that information in the description for you guys if you are interested. So let's get to planning. I'm going to start... I don't know where to start. I'm so excited. Okay. So, um, let's just start planning. Let's, yeah. I'll do my functional stuff first, and then we will work the flowers around it. How about that? So, I did not think I would become a fan of the food logging. Like I said in my last video, you guys who have been... Uh, watching me know how much I did not like the food logging but I am actually becoming a fan I think this is really gonna help me um, so far it has helped me because I remember that I have to write in everything I eat um, <clears throat> so that kind of helps. And I, I, I'm hoping that, I like, I feel like I have that part, like the eating. Well, it's hard to say. I, I don't want to get too cocky with it right now because it's only been a week. So I, I don't want to do that. Because every time I put stuff like that out in the atmosphere, I get tested. And I'll be like, first of all, oh, it doesn't bother me. I can eat healthy all week. This is fun. And then tomorrow I'm like, if I could just get a bag of chips. If I could just get a chip. So I'm not going to say that. Um, last week was pretty, pretty easy. And I think it was easy because I pre-planned. And um, I had everything that I needed. And I had nothing bad in the house to eat. So, I will say that. Because there were some nights now. That that craving hits, that craving hits me like 10.30, 11 o'clock. I could be knocked out. I mean, out. I will wake up and that craving be so strong on me. Y'all, I can't. I can't, so. I can't have this, I can't have any bad things in my house because they will get eaten. Period. No questions asked. I'm not worried about portion control. 
I'm not checking for calories. I'm not checking for anything. I'm checking for my hand in that bag, period. That's all she wrote. So, if it's not here, I can't eat it. And I'll be mad eating them strawberries, but guess what? <laughs> I'll be glad in the morning because there's a lot of times where that happens and I wake up and I'm like so mad at myself like oh gosh you did it again last night you should have just stayed asleep why did you have to and it's like I hate the guilt after now while I'm eating it oh it's going down okay I am excited I'm in my glory but afterwards it's like why, why did you do that? So, I'm like, I just can't have this stuff in the house. I don't trust myself. I have proven myself to be untrustworthy <laughs> when it comes to snacks in the house. So, that's where I am with that. No snacks in the house. Why is the sticker giving me an issue? And it's still crooked. It's always one. Off. I was trying to look for different water trackers, but the ones I wanted to use didn't fill the box, and then I would have to think of ways to fill the box. So I was like, okay, this is just too much. So we are rolling with this. I have my bottle that I was using, the gallon bottle. Remember, I was using that before. I stopped using that, so I have to get back on that because that actually helped. I was actually drinking more than I drank without using the bottle, so we're gonna keep, we're gonna put that back in rotation. Okay. So we got all our functional stuff, my water, food log, workout will be down there. Um, I feel like there won't be much room, but we're going to make it work because I need to brighten this page up. I'm trying to figure out where I want to place this. I don't know, does that look weird? We'll see. All right, let's, um... <clears throat> Too small. 
I don't want them to look too thin. Okay, let's put her here. And then let's get a quote. Oh, I love that. It's so cute. Okay. Um, or should I put a paper quote? I think I'm going to go with the clear. Let's do this. Should I have a flower or a piece of floral coming out? too much I don't want it to seem like she's standing in the jungle <laughs> Let's use this one. Okay, and then <clears throat> I pulled so many, I pulled so many um, black and white quotes because I thought I was going to have, well, not a lot. A few others in there on the side there. Okay. Hmm. Let's 
What about this one? Work for it. Like something needs to go there. But what? Perfect. And then I got these little eat well. <clears throat> I got a tickle in my nose. Still finish strong there. Because you guys know Fridays is the struggle day. And... I don't know where to put this. <laughs> oh gosh, that's too funny. I'll put it here. Okay. I got one more. I'm trying to use all the ones I pulled. So I don't have to try to find what book this goes to. Make it happen. Okay. Should we do the all oh, the habit trackers? Oh, that's for the week. Um, <clears throat> let's see. I don't remember what book those were in. The habit trackers I had. Okay, if I could find out, if I could remember which book they're in. gonna bug me now. Because I don't want to throw the color off though, so. Yeah. Oh wait, they have the orange ones in there. What book is that? It's the orange one. Do I have a new one? Because all of my other habit trackers are used. I think those are like almost the first things to go. Hmm. 
gonna bug me now. Okay, so this week, oh, I could have used, no, those are too big. This week I'm going to focus on I don't know what I'll look after. If I could get the colors, then then I'll if I can get this color, then I'll put them on the side before I take my picture. But um, because I I use all my habit trackers, and that's from especially if it was from a new book, then okay. But from my from the Orange Fitness, yeah, I don't. I could have just stumbled upon those. I'm not sure. Okay, so let's put this into a frame. This is my layout for this week. This video seems kind of quick. I like florals and the girls. It's on point. I got all of my motivational quotes. I have my water trackers, food logging, my workouts is on the bottom. I will look for those habit trackers um, in orange or yellow. I'll put those on the side. That's it. So that's my plan for the week is to keep logging my food, working out. Um, I'm still going to record my steps. I'm going to do it how I did it last week, just writing them in. On the bottom here that's fine it's not an issue um I don't know I kind of like this layout I mean I like the way it came out with the flowers and the and the girlies um, came out better then I I don't know I did I wasn't sure how it was gonna come out but I don't think it came out too bad just with the black and some florals So that's it, you guys. So let's kill it this week. I can't believe we are nearing the end of January. We got two weeks and I have to weigh in um, for February 1st. So I think that's another thing that's keeping me from, like, I literally am so mindful, like, no. You have to. And you know what else is, is helping me too? I need to see the difference with my eating healthy and working out. That's what I want to say. Because honestly, sometimes you don't know how something is or how bad it is or how good it is until you're not doing it. So I noticed this week, this past week when I was eating well, I... It, I think it's it it did hit me like yeah girl you really was not eating very very well and even though it was it wasn't every day it was a couple of days out of the week it still wasn't good and the weekend so it's like almost like I ate pretty good during the week and then the weekends you can forget about it so it maybe it was almost like working off what I ate every weekend. And then by the time I work that off, here's the weekend again, and there you go. So, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm excited to see um, what the difference is. And it doesn't matter if it's not a huge number or whatever. I'm still going to keep doing it because it's what I need to do. I need to eat right and I need to exercise. So, I, I'll be glad whatever. I, it'll be hard to be that excited for a pound but I will take it in stride and just say you just started eating healthy the last couple of weeks of January relax so I won't get down and I won't beat myself up because it's a lifestyle thing I'm just going to keep doing it anyway so there is that so thank you all for joining me this week in this video. This is my fitness plan with me video for January 17th through the 23rd. 
almost, like I said, almost at the end of January. I hope you guys go out and kill it this week and give it your all. And I will definitely be rooting for everyone. Um, so that's it. And I will talk to you guys later. Have a good week. Bye.